Back to the markets. We're still on the upside pretty much across the board, actually across the board. Dow up 300, Nasdaq up 100. Look who's here, David Barnson, man himself. All right, David, I'll ask you the same question I've asked a lot of people this week and last week too. Is the bull market over? Uh, I'm not sure that the bull market is over, but I do think it's going to slow down, Stuart. I think you're going to have a slower rate of growth in the year ahead, and particularly some of those high PE and those growth stocks are going to slow down. But you know I'm here to talk about the dividend stuff. Yep. I think those are still at low valuations. Okay. I, I know you brought two dividend picks with you. First off, H&R Block. Tell me, how much does it pay and why you like it? Oh, it pays close to 4% dividend, but I like it because it's undervalued, cheap stock that doesn't require a lot of capital. It's not uh, dealing with a ton of debt. So if they raise interest rates, it doesn't blow out the company. We want to be defensive next year about highly levered companies. So H&R Block does not have a debt profile that concerns us, and it has growing free cash flow. What does Apollo Global Management pay? Well, like your friends at Blackstone, Apollo adjusts their dividend quarter by quarter to the cash flow. Yep. So Apollo, I can't give you a stable number, but it's targeting 5% for next Ooh. year. We think it's going to beat that. And the stock is actually down a little bit in the last couple of weeks after being up huge all year. So it's a good entry point. 5% dividend next year, very diversified business. How do you feel about AT&T? Because I'm pricing it around $24 a share, and at that price it yields, I think, around 7%, if I'm not mistaken. That's a very healthy yield. You don't trust it? You don't think it's going to be maintained? Well, we know it's not going to be maintained. They already did a dividend cut. And so there's only two things people can do to upset David Bonson right now. One is ask a six-year-old kid to wear a mask. And two is cut a dividend. And AT&T <laughs> cut their dividend, so they're dead to me. They're dead to you. Okay. All right, David. <laughs> That's pretty clean cut, i got to say. We appreciate that. <laughs> David Barnes and everyone, we'll see you again real soon.